What's going on, everybody here, and welcome back. So I, you know what? I don't like to get into the tea with things. I like to try to stay out of the drama, but there's some things going on with this whole Genshin thing, McDonald's collab thing, that uh, that I feel like everybody, that I feel like you should know. I'm um, passing along information, personal information that that I have gotten with this whole thing. Um, there's a lot of issues regarding the codes. People buying the meals, people signing up for the apps, and not getting the codes. So. The codes are taking a while to come out. Um, this is such a widespread issue that if you call in to the corporate McDonald's thing, if you just go like, it's like 1-800 Big Macs or something like that. If you call that number, they have a pre-recorded thing saying, if you are calling about the Genshin Impact codes, blah, 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 all this stuff, they're like working on it and stuff like that. They're, you know, so it is a very widespread thing. Now, the thing that kills me, and the reason I'm making this video is there has been an update for us. So we called yesterday. They said we had to wait 24 hours. We waited 24 hours. We did get a code for the pies. So we did get the other code finally. Um, but this is the other part of it. If you guys remember, if you watched the first video, we bought four meals. Um, we bought four meals at the time because the promotional material says valid one X per apple pie or Genshin meal purchase at participating McDonald's for a limited time. Must opt in to email and rewards before purchase. Okay, that's exactly what it says word for word, just read it. Now, most people would take that. I feel like I'm a, a fairly intellectual person. I typically read the fine print of, uh, you know, it's like, okay, hey, we need to do this, we need to do this. To me, that sounds like it is per purchase because it says one X per apple pie or Genshin meal purchase. Now, typically a purchase is a list of things that you get in an order, right? You purchase this, you purchase this, you purchase this, this is your order. So typically if it's a one per purchase, you can get multiple per order. So most of the time it will say limit one per order, two per order, whatever, if it's an order issue. Or it'll say in the case of this per account. That's right, so we got off the phone we got on the phone, we called them, uh, they, we had to do the callback thing, they called us five hours later, and we got on the phone with them, and they told us it is one meal and one pie code per account, per email address associated with the app. So if you want multiple codes, you have to have multiple different app logins. Nowhere does it say that at all. Like absolutely nothing can be confused with one per account. And it just, it irritates me. Like I said, I like it, it, you know, I get it. You know what, McDonald's is doing what they're doing. Genshin's doing what they're doing. I don't, I'm not like holding either one like personally responsible, but um, I feel like the marketing is, for lack of a better word, it's deliberately misleading. And the reason I say it's deliberately misleading is because in the fine print, they say it is one per apple pie or Genshin meal purchase. So they're addressing the fact that people are gonna want multiples. They know people are gonna want multiples, so they have to say, hey, you only get one per thing, right? Because people are gonna want multiples. But they don't say it's one per account. They say one per purchase. Now, somebody could argue and say, hey, you know, one apple pie, one Genshin meal per purchase. You could argue translation wise, maybe that means per order, right? Okay, cool, I can understand that. So it's like, you buy one with one order, you buy one with the next order, you get another one. That is the reasonable expectation of everybody. Nobody, according to the material, promotional material, nobody is expecting it to be one per account. So how many people did they trick into buying either A, multiple orders per accounts or multiple things at the same time trying to get multiple codes because it says one per purchase, most people think I will purchase four in my order and get four codes. Nope, not gonna get that. Okay, I'm gonna purchase one today. I'm gonna purchase one tomorrow. I'll get a code for today. I'll get a code for tomorrow. Nope, cause it's per account. So this is where I'm like, I'm, I, I, I normally don't care, like whatever, you know, fine print details, stuff like that. But to me, this is directly misleading. It says absolutely nowhere per account. And it's just, it's frustrating because I myself, like I have four people in my family that play Genshin. So we bought four of the McCrispy meals, which by the way, nobody wants a freaking McCrispy meal. Nobody wants that. Everybody's buying it just because of the Genshin thing. You're not selling the McCrispy meals in our record numbers because, oh my God, everyone wants the McCrispy. No, 
They don't. They want the code, and you're doing that deliberately. Now, just to give you an idea of like why I'm so like why I'm actually like irritated about this, I get irritated when bigger companies try to take advantage of small people, of just the everyday customer. Because not a lot of people like, I mean, right now times are tough for like everybody. You know, money is a little tight for everybody. And a McCrispy meal for my location, prices vary where you're at. They're more expensive some places or cheaper some other places. But in Arkansas, it's about $10. It's like $9.95 for a McCrispy meal. Let's just say hypothetically, just to give you a ballpark idea of what I'm talking about here. Let's just say hypothetically, in the entire United States, 10,000 people bought two McCrispies because they thought they were gonna get two coats, right? 10, I feel like that's being relatively conservative, even if it's like just for the week, right? Let's say that there was 10,000 McCrispy meals that were sold in addition to another one because they wanted an extra coat. There's two people in the household. That's just two. That's a hundred thousand dollars of revenue. Well, now I, I don't, I'm not gonna get into the like revenue because you know, the cost of materials all stuff. but you know what I mean? That's a hundred thousand dollars of generated sales that they knew they weren't gonna fulfill the code request for. Like they knew, hey, these people, they're not gonna get the code. It's one per account. Like they all ordered an extra one. They're not gonna get it. I honestly, it's it's just, it's it's to me, it's deliberately misleading. Uh, none of the promotional material says this. All of the fine print everywhere I've seen. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. Happily, I will happily accept if I'm wrong. Everything I've seen, and unless they change it, which I could absolutely see them re-promote, re-pushing out the promotional material that says one per account, but it's too late. The promotional material has already been set out. I have copies of it everywhere that says otherwise. So if you're ordering it, if you want to get it, the only way to get multiple codes right now, from what I was told directly from McDonald's on the phone, is one per account. So that's one meal and one pie code per account. Now, keep in mind, I'm not gonna make an account for my kids. Why would I make four accounts? It's ridiculous. The thing says purchase, it doesn't say per account. So it's just, it's irritating. Normally I don't care, normally I don't get into it, but I feel like in this case, like I said, I feel like it's directly misleading. I feel like it's, it's not, it's just, it's not right. It, you know what I mean? If there was some other fine detail somewhere, that said it, then I could, I could get on board with that. But like everything on the promotional material says the exact same thing. Valid one X per apple pie, Genshin purchase at participating in McDonald's for a limited time. Now the other part of this, which is a little bit more pointy hat speculation, is this was only available through the app. So to me, this promotion was McDonald's saying, hey, we're gonna work with this company because we wanna push people to the app. We wanna get app signup numbers up. We wanna get app downloads up. We wanna get our, you know, we wanna get our, we wanna get the, you know, the ratings associated with all the apps or whatever. We wanna get that up because we want more people using the app instead of, you know, going in store. Most, I don't know if you know, but every time you walk, every time you go through drive, will you be using the mobile app? I feel like this is a push to get more and more and more people to use the mobile app and order for themselves. Why? Because they don't have to hire as many people to work the counter anymore. I mean, they already have the kiosks that are terrible and don't work half the time, along with their milkshake machines or ice cream machines. Like, let's not even get into those, but uh, uh, I feel like it's just another push to get you to use something so that, again, they can save money elsewhere. And it's just irritating. It's just irritating. But I don't know. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think. And share this video like like i mean do what you want to do i put it out on twitter as well i'll have a link down below to my, my twitter thing if you want to leave a like on it you know maybe get some more traction on it so other people can see it it is one code one meal code one apple pie code per order is what it is or per per account per account not per order per account it's i know i don't know i don't know we'll see we'll see but yeah to me definitely uh Mm, it doesn't sit well with me, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um, again, like the video, leave a like so it gets more traction. Share the video, post it wherever you want, whatever you want to do, and I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.